Yo, what's up guys, it's Amit, and have you ever wondered how to get the old iTunes app icon back? I always wanted to get it back because the new icon really sucked in my opinion. I didn't really like the white, and I really liked the red part, and I've been wondering on how to get this back for a very long time, and I finally figured it out. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to change your iTunes app icon back to the original version. Let's go. So the first thing you're going to need to do is you need to download these files. This is the default one, I, which I don't like. I, I saved this copy just in case I had to revert. But this, you can find it on Google. Just search in iTunesRed.ICNS, and you will find that. So just keep these on your desktop. So what you're going to do now is just you're going to open up two Finder windows. You just have to go to the Finder and just open a new Finder window. And on one of them, go to your applications. And on one of them, stay where you have the uh, logos right here. So we're gonna go into iTunes right here. Mine's the new version already. Uh, so I mean the old version. So like yeah, uh, we're gonna double uh, double tap this and we're gonna click on Get Info first. You see Get Info right here. All right, and what you wanna do right here? It's very simple. All you have to do is drag your old logo right here and just drag it onto this. It's as easy as that. And I do not want to get this old logo back, but that's easy as it is. You just have to click OK, authenticate it. And then your icon will not update right away. So what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to swipe it up. You gotta remove it from your dock, and then you gotta re-add it. You gotta slide it back from here. You gotta drag it back down, and you will have the new iTunes logo. iTunes works perfectly fine. It's working the exact same way as it always did. And but you just have the new logo, and it's way better in my opinion. All right. So another thing that you might have to do is you have to go into iTunes and click Show Package Contents. Go into Contents. Go into Resources. And you'll see the iTunes, the ICNS. You're going to have this old version right here, or technically the new icon right here. All you're going to have to do is just rename your old one, like the one that you want to download. Any custom icon, you can name it iTunes, the ICNS, and just drag it in here and replace it. And it's easy as that. And then just follow the other instructions, and you'll be ready to go. So if you guys enjoyed that video, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. And if you want more tutorials like this, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out. Oh, and if my voice sounds a little stuffy right here in this video, I'm a little sick right now, so excuse that. I'll be back on the next video. I hope I'll be good. Peace out.